What if I told you that there's waves out there yeah. that glow in the dark? I'd say, what have you been smoking? <laughs> Whoa! Okay. That's not, that's not real. It is, That's sorry. real? Yeah? That's real footage. Wow, that's cool. Glowing waves. It's not a camera trick. The water is actually flashing and glowing. What's causing this light show? And is it safe? The photos from Jarvis Bay in Australia are out of this world. But it's real. Whenever you see videos on the internet, that's actually what you see with the naked eye. When I first saw Bio for the first time, I thought I was hallucinating. I had absolutely no idea what it was. Uh, what's going on? What, what's happening? What's that called? Bioluminescence. Bioluminescence. Bioluminescence is the generation and emission of light by living organisms, phytoplankton generally, uh, so microscopic organisms. Like land plants, phytoplankton perform photosynthesis. They contain these light harvesting pigments and they can discolour the water. And this discoloration can be anything from a bright red colour to pink to brown to green. And then at night, when that light is not externally present, they are able to generate their own light through bioluminescence. And this is a completely different colour in that sort of milky white blue glow. Often the glowing plankton is Noctiluca scintillans, also known as sea sparkle. Dean was sailing overnight when a glint caught his eye. It's pitch black everywhere, but clear as day below us are these amazing, beautiful dolphins glowing bright blue and green in bioluminescence. The brain is just struggling to work out what's going on. The dolphins were, you guessed it, swimming through bioluminescent plankton. It seemed to like intensify as there was some sort of movement connected to it. What was causing that? Often mechanical stimulation causes this chemical reaction between luciferase, an enzyme, and luciferin to generate oxyluciferin as the product. And in that process, light is emitted. This chemical reaction is like cracking a glow stick, but plankton aren't the only critter with this special skill. Interestingly, the ocean contains most of the organisms that bioluminesce. So that include fishes and squids, bacteria, worms. Anglerfish that live in the deep ocean have a lure at the front of their heads, and this uh, enables them to attract prey that <laughs> unsurprisingly get caught out um, when they venture too close. And then things like phytoplankton bioluminesce, and we don't really understand why. But there are some studies that show that phytoplankton, that bioluminesce, are consumed less by zooplankton. So it may be also a predator evasion tactic. So why does this happen in Java's Bay of all places? Well, it's simple geography. You see, the bay's restricted entrance and limited tidal exchange means that whatever comes to the bay stays. 20 years after his first encounter, Jarvis Bay local David Finlay has become a bio junkie. I can literally see bio every night in the water and the excitement wouldn't wane. David, so what I've got here in front of me is a photo. You're nude and blue. That gets a lot of mileage, that one. <laughs> can you please explain yourself? So I don't recommend this. This is one of the crazy things that I've done. Tasted terrible. Yeah, I got it in my mouth and I had to spit it out. It just tastes absolutely disgusting. And I smelt like bio for two days, even though I was scrubbing really hard to get rid of it. Like a fishy odor? It smells really bad. It has like a, a very, very rotten uh, ammonia uh, smell. And actually, that's one of the byproducts I think that the uh, Noctilucus interlands gives off. If you see it and you want to jump in the water, is it dangerous? I wouldn't recommend swallowing seawater with lots of Noctiluca in it. <laughs> Not good for your microbiome. It's certainly safe for children to splash in uh, and so forth, but just give them a good bath. Thanks for watching. Check out more weird and wonderful videos here. And if you like our stuff on ABC Science, then please subscribe. See ya.